Good morning. This morning I would like to review a pipe tobacco that I have been wanting to review for quite some time. It is one of my absolute favorites. Let's see if I have a tin close by. I had a tin of it, finished it rather quickly, and um, bought a whole bunch of it in bulk. And that tobacco is Dunhill's Early Morning Pipe. So, as you can see, it's early morning here on a Saturday. I'm having a nice cup of coffee and a bowl of early morning pipe. So let's talk about it. It's very similar to a lot of the other Dunhill blends. Um, My Mixer 965, uh, London, uh, and those. Um, I'd say that definitely Virginia is the star of the show. Um, what does it actually have in it? Okay, so I just checked online and early morning pipe, sweet oriental, carefully blended with bright and red Virginias, pressed and lightly stoved, great as a first pipe, arousing the palate for future, I'm sorry, further pleasures of the day. And <clears throat> according to this, it says that it is Latakia, oriental and Virginia. Well, I'd say... Uh, you, there is a uh, definitely it, the the Virginia and the Orientals are actually very well balanced out. Um, to be honest, it's um, it uh, creates very smooth and creamy flavor. Um, the tang of the Virginia is kind of reminds me of orange juice. It really when you when you when you take a that first sniff of the tin when you open it, it really reminds reminded me of like bacon and eggs and coffee with a tall glass of fresh squeezed orange juice and I had that breakfast before I smoked my first bowl and it was amazing so uh, I don't know if I've actually ever smoked EMP not in the morning I don't know maybe I'm just uh, that kind of guy it, it is a really good first pipe that this is a really good anytime pipe um, there is a lot of Kia definitely as pretty much any English blend's gonna have. I mean, it's almost a standard. But um, English blends don't necessarily have to have Latakia. <clears throat> In fact, uh, I guess the terminology would be Latakia blend. Um, but it's not overwhelming. It's uh, quite mild. It's uh, very much condiment tobacco in the background. Um, now let's talk about bulk versus tin because I smoked a whole tin of it and then I bought it in bulk it's not too much of a difference um, I think that the flavor was more concentrated in the tin <clears throat> um, but all in all it's pretty much the same in bulk um, moisture content in the bulk is a little bit drier it's still pretty moist so you're probably going to want to dry it out a little bit um, now I'm just you know, talking a lot here, but you can see if it's gone out a few times on me, and I pulled it straight out of the the jar and uh, packed it in. I guess I put the jar back, but um, yeah, this is one of my new all-time favorite pipes. It is a Saturday morning tradition for me. Wife goes to work, I make some breakfast, and I puff away on an early morning pipe and have a nice cup of coffee with it. And it is one of my favorite things to do. Um, I highly recommend Early Morning Pipe if you haven't smoked it yet. Um, as far as Dunhill blends go, it's quite mild. It is not very strong. Um, I've read reports online uh, on people who are sensitive to nicotine 
Some people have said there's none at all, and some people have fallen on the floor. Uh, me personally, doesn't. I'm not bothered by it. Um, it's not a royal yacht, that's for sure. But, you know, after breakfast, small bowl, even a big bowl. It's, uh, it's a perfect thing. So that is uh, Dunhill's Early Morning Pipe. It is one of my all-time recommended. I highly recommend that you get this one. We'll see you next time.